Hey everybody, it's Carol with Free Spirit Arts. This video uh, doesn't really have any substantial content except that I wanted to let everybody know that I am probably going to do a drawing for the first birthday month giveaway this afternoon. Um, so as an excuse to get online and tell you guys that, I thought I'd show you, give you a status, craft room status update. I know if you're, if this is the first time you're seeing this room, <laughs> you're probably like, whoa. <laughs> it really is organized chaos now. Um, my goal was to get the big stuff in place or at least put it somewhere where I could decide if that's where it's going to stay and then I'll move things around from there. Um, as you can see the ceilings come down at a slant so that that makes for some creative decorating. I think this corner is probably going to be the best place for the television. I think I probably will leave that table there for the television. Of course, all the little chotskis on there will probably move a little bit, but I think these are going to stay where they are. Um, it seems like a good place. This, the this and that are basically placeholders for the desk that's coming next week. I like that L shape because I like having the sewing machine just so I can spin around and use it. The pegboards will definitely stay where they are because they're too big to move. Um, but they're going to be different. I want to go get some shelving for them. My printer and everything is going to go in that back room. Uh, it's just too big. It's a huge laser printer. I, uh, I'm trying to figure out how I can be able to have views of outside. And I, I don't know how that's going to happen. I can pull my new desk this way. And... Or even put it in the middle. But I don't know. Having the desk here is going to help a lot. But yeah, I just stuffed things in those cubbies. Um, when I moved, I used these little envelopes to pack everything in. And there is kind of a rhyme to it, but they don't, none of that is going to stay in there. I love these little tables that I got from Ikea. No, I'm lying to you. Hobby Lobby. I caved. I've never been to Hobby Lobby and I've been there twice now. I caved. These wooden shelves I got from Ikea, my daughter bought those for me in my old craft room and I really like them. They're lightweight. They're easy to put together. Quick to move. This is probably not going to stay. It's actually going to go to the cabin. But we didn't have anywhere else to put it. I really like the furniture here. Um, but the contents that's inside that will all change. Some of it's going to go in the desk. And some of it's going to go in the trash. <laughs> I don't think I'll use this little brown shelf uh, for yarn and stuff. I think, I think, I think I'm going to put it on that. I just have to decide where to put that. Or I have another one kind of like it. I might use it. But making use of the wall space is um, really a challenge. And I have all of these Ikea pegboards. I have six, and they're 24 by 18, I think. So I have to figure out where those are going to go. So 
This is a status update. I thought the room was going to be put together tomorrow today, but clearly it's I just keep moving stuff from one stack to another trying to figure out where the big stuff's going to go. Then I'll worry about the little stuff, the contents. So that's my update. So I probably will do a giveaway this afternoon. We've got some errands to run and some phone calls to make, so I can't do it right now. But I will clear off my desk and get my laptop out and use the comment picker. Um, I tried to go back in the videos and mark them all so that you can comment on all of them. Um, because, like I've talked about before, I, I have several giveaways already prepared and I want to be able to I can't use the same video over and over again so I'm going to pick randomly from one of the several and I'll do that a few times because I want to give away a few giveaways okay so if you have not commented um, on the videos go back and scroll on them and of course I'd love it if you'd like them. Give me a thumbs up. I would love that. Um, you do have to be subbed and you have to comment. I think that's the only two rules. I probably will um, eliminate multiple comments. You're welcome to comment and I love that. I like getting to know everybody. But it doesn't matter if you comment more than once. So don't feel like you have to fill the comment section with a bunch of comments. But So... That's where I'm at, guys. Just a quick video to let you know I'm going to try to do a giveaway today. All right. So everybody take care. Let's take care of each other. Bye for now.